Hi there, thank you for tuning in to monoprice.com on our YouTube channel. My name is Sean Blatherick of the Monoprice Tech Support Team. Today's tutorial will be showing you how to choose the right screen protector for your portable devices. Today we can find three different types of protectors. The high transparency screen protectors, matte finish protectors, and the mirror finish protector. Let's see what the difference is between these screen protectors. The high transparency finish protector protects your screen from harm. This screen protector allows for better vision and bright daylight. The matte finish protector is just a little bit less transparent and blocks 99% of UV rays. The mirror finish protector turns your display into a mirror. It is our most thickest and most durable and also make your device with a unique style. No matter what kind of screen protector you choose, all these protectors have one thing in common. Protect your screen from dust, scratches, and damage. Now I'm going to show you how to install your screen protector on your device. First thing you want to make sure, this is a little secret, when you mix a hot surface with a cold surface, that can create an air bubble. My advice to you is to turn off your device for about 10 to 15 minutes, let it cool off. That way, you have a cold surface going on a cold surface, and you can avoid all those air bubbles. Now the first thing you want to do is you want to clean your device, get it free of any oils, dirt, and dust by using one of our Monoprice screen cleaning kits. So first, you're going to open up this, and you take the duster. You want to dust, get it free of any dust. If you have any dust inside of here when you put the screen protector on, it's going to cause a lot of problems, a lot of air bubbles, and those are very difficult to get out. Next, you're going to take your dusting cloth, make sure it gets free of all dust and debris and dirt. Now that your screen is clean, you are ready to install your perfect protective film. Now if you look at this screen, you're going to have two different steps. You're going to see two tabs. It says step one and step two. The side of step one, the side of step two. There's actually two sides to this. First you got the sticky side to stick onto there, and then you got another protector for when you get the air bubbles out. So what you do is you go ahead and you're going to Pull this back just a little bit. Now at this point, you're going to go ahead and you're going to need to align the hole with your home button. This may take some time, so be patient. Once you have that aligned, go ahead and peel the rest of it back and lay it perfectly flat. And you see, I just have a very few air bubbles in here because I let it cool down before I went ahead and installed it. Next, you're going to go ahead and you're going to take your soft card that came with the protective film you're just going to go ahead and brush the bubbles out of the corner. Now that you've gotten all of your air bubbles out, it's time for step two, where you peel away nice and slowly, just like that. Once you've pulled that apart, go ahead and take your cloth, give it one last final cleaning. Make sure you get every piece off. Just like that. And now, you're finished. To find this and other products on the web, go to www.monoprice.com. On the menu bar, click the Accessories button. Then you can choose and click the Blackberry icon, iPad and Tablets icon, or iPod and iPhone icon. Just choose the one you prefer. If you need help or have any other questions, feel free to contact Monoprice Tech Support Team via live chat at monoprice.com. Once again, my name is Sean Blatherwick, and I hope this tutorial will be helpful. Thank you for watching it, and see you next time.